had a cat, and a very tall hat, and long ginger hair which he wore in a plait. How the cat purred, and how the witch grinned as they sat on their broomstick and flew through the wind. But how the witch wailed, and how the cat spat! When the wind blew so wildly, it blew off the hat. Down! cried the witch, and they flew to the ground. They searched for the hat, but no hat could be found. Then out of the bushes, on thundering paws, there bounded a dog with the hat in his jaws. He dropped it politely, then eagerly said, as the witch pulled the hat firmly down on her head, "I am a dog, as keen as can be. Is there room on the broom for a dog like me?" "Yes," cried the witch, and the dog clambered on. <coughs> The witch tapped the broomstick, and whoosh! They were gone. <laughs> Over the fields and the forests they flew. The dog wagged his tail, and the stormy wind blew. <laughs> The witch laughed aloud and held on to her hat, but away blew the bow from her long ginger plait. <coughs> Down! cried the witch, and they flew to the ground. They searched for the bow, but no bow could be found. Oh. Ah. ah! Then out from a tree with an ear-splitting shriek, there flapped a green bird with the bow in her beak. Ah! She dropped it politely and bent her head low. Then said, as the witch tied her plait in a bow, "I am a bird as green as can be. Is there room on the broom for a bird like me?" "Yes," cried the witch. So the bird fluttered on. <coughs> the witch tapped the broomstick, and whoosh! They were gone. <coughs> <Ooh> . <laughs> Over the reeds and the rivers they flew. The bird shrieked with glee, and the stormy wind blew. They shot through the sky to the back of beyond. The witch clutched her bow, but let go of her wand. Oh. Oh. Down! cried the witch. And they flew to the ground. They searched for the wand, but no wand could be found. <coughs> Then, all of a sudden, from out of a pond, leapt a dripping wet frog with a dripping wet wand. Ah! He dropped it politely, then said with a croak, as the witch dried the wand on a fold of her cloak. I am a frog, as clean as can be. Is there room on the broom for a frog like me? Yes, said the witch. So the frog bounded on. 
the witch tapped the broomstick, and whoosh, they were gone. <laughs> Over the moors and the mountains they flew. <coughs> the frog jumped for joy and the broom snapped in two. Down fell the cat <laughs> and the dog and the frog. Down they went tumbling into a...